We tend to think of a bird's eye view as something special, but that may not be the case. In fact, birds' blurry vision and blind spots are coming to the fore in arguments against this proposed new foot and bike bridge over Highway 101 in Palo Alto. Birds do not see the way we do. Their eyes are the side of their heads, not in front. They don't focus as well. Some of them, if they have long beaks, the beak actually creates a blind spot. Dr. Shani Kleinhaus of the Audubon Society worries that there could be many unnecessary bird kills if Palo Alto approves the design known as Confluence. With its 75-foot arch and web of suspension cables, Confluence was supposed to be a landmark. It was the top pick of a jury of architects in an international design competition. But its location along Adobe Creek, right next to the Palo Alto Baylands Nature Preserve, has environmental groups speaking out. We know that my Migratory and local species collide with a lot of different structures that people put in their way, whether it's power lines or buildings or, in this case, a bridge. Bridge designer sent a letter to the city council claiming that similar footbridges in bird habitats, including this one at Kelly Park in San Jose, have not resulted in bird kills. Bridge designers also say their plans incorporate bird-friendly features such as five-inch steel discs, similar in size to this compact disc, which would be put on the cables themselves to alert the birds of the bridge's presence. Kleinhaus says that's no guarantee to keep birds safe and recommends the city adopt a low-profile bridge design that was the second pick. A lot of bird traffic around here. One neighbor who plans to use the bridge often says a grand design is not important to him. That's overkill. We just need to get over the freeway. In Palo Alto, Len Ramitas, KPIX 5.